What is up, party people? It is your boy Voltron with another Anchor video. We've been talking about social media and how it's going to be big for Web3 mass adoption. And Anchor knows this. Um, a lot of companies know it as well. Coinbase, Binance, and they are all working together to make this possible. So, being on social media means that there's going to be a need for artists. You know, musicians, people who compose videos, um, talent that's out there. They need to get onto Web3, so we got to start getting them on board. But let's say you are a guitar master. You know how to play the guitar. You can drop a note quickly. But how many guitarists know how to code? See, it gets tricky. If we're trying to bring in content creators and they don't know how to code, how are they going to get on? They can pay someone to do it, but then that's going to turn off a lot of people because let's say you're starting off as an artist. You may not have the money. So there's a new kid on the block, Create Protocol, and there's rumors that anchors in the mix helping them out. And they're finding ways. They're creating a new way. They're creating infrastructure that uses AI to make it possible for content creators to launch on Web3. If they want to create an NFT, they can do it with no code needed. So this is pretty big news. I mean, we may not see it now, but as we move forward, we are going to see the need to make it easier for people who have no coding experience to get on Web3 because mass adoption will require social media. Um, I, I remember reading somewhere that most people who shop, you know, like say the younger crowds, the 18 to 30 year olds who do the most shopping, decide what to shop based on what they see on social media. So getting social media onto Web3 is becoming crucial and create protocol with rumors of Anchor being in the mix is going to make that possible. Until next time guys, peace out.